The name of this drill is 10-4. Now you're gonna put your five guys on defense in whatever press you run, man press or zone press. Then you're gonna get five guys on offense and they're gonna be running their press break. Now the defense has to score 10 points. The defense will get one point per deflection, one point per steal, one point per forced turnover, and one point per basket. Now the offense has to score four points and they will get one point per basket. Let's go ahead and take a look at this drill. All right, so here we are, we're in our press defense. We're in a man press. We usually get a three up. To start off the drill, we get a back tip. That's gonna be a point for the defense. Anytime a game is over, we're just gonna go ahead and reset, let the offense set up and get our defense set up as well. Here, you're gonna see the offense throw the ball out of bounds. That's gonna be a forced turnover, so that's a point for the defense. Sure, this drill is great, like for your press to get deflections and all those things, but something else is gonna simulate is your guys are gonna have to convert from their press defense and get matched up. If you're in man-to-man -man or if you're in a zone, they're just gonna have to communicate and convert to their half-court defense, and that's something I love about this drill. Here you can kind of see us get into a scramble, but we're able to get matched up. I'll also let us get out and run a little bit, you know, a little bit of transition offense because we can't simulate this game speed all the time. Here we get another back tip. We get a player diving on the floor for a loose ball. That's two more points that puts the defense up four to zero. I mean, this is a great conditioning drill too, man. Our guys are just constantly working. Another forced turnover, that's another point for the defense, is 5-0. See, here we're really able to get the offense sped up. They make a quick pass, it's a quick shot, and I think the speed kind of leads to a missed layup, and it just allows us to get out and run. I mean, here our transition offense looks horrible, but we're also able to set up our half-court offense and have to work through some actions. So you're able to kind of see us go from like this transition offense to our half court offense, which obviously needs some work. Once once again, you see we get beat. That's going to happen. Anytime you're picking people up full court, you're going to get beat. It forces us to have to convert to our half court defense. That's just something I love about this drill. Here, our defenders do a good job of not allowing anything up the middle. Ball gets thrown out of bounds. That's a forced turnover. 6-0 to the defense. I love seeing the back tips. Here we get another point. 7-0. We got guys diving on the floor. Leads to a turnover. We'll give them a point for that just for the hustle. So it's 8-0. Once again, just having to convert into the half court, we're able to get a steal. That's going to be our ninth point. We get out and run a little bit, and Collins is able to finish a floater. Gets us to 10. 10-0 for the defense.